Welcome to the Rewind Zone, and thanks for joining us. The year is 1978, the film is going south. Let's update some cast members, shall we? Jack Nicholson played Henry Moon. He was born in Neptune City, New Jersey on April the 22nd, 1937. Nicholson was 41 years old in 1978, and he is currently 86 years old in 2023. Jack Nicholson is widely recognized as one of the all-time great actors. Throughout his five-decade career, he has garnered countless honors, including three Academy Awards, six Golden Globe Awards, and three BAFTA Awards. His most famous films include One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest, The Shining, and As Good As It Gets. Christopher Lloyd played Tofield. He was born in Stamford, Connecticut on October 22, 1938. In 1978, Lloyd was 34 years old. He is currently 84 years old in 2023. Christopher Lloyd is best known for his iconic role as Dr. Emmett Brown in the Back to the Future trilogy. He has also appeared in films like One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest and Who Framed Roger Rabbit. Additionally, he gained recognition for his portrayal of Uncle Fester in the Addams Family films. John Belushi played Hector. He was born in Chicago, Illinois on January 24, 1949. In 1978, Belushi was 28 years old. Belushi's life was tragically cut short and he died on March 5, 1982 to an overdose at the age of 33. John Belushi is remembered for his comedic talent and his work on the sketch comedy show Saturday Night Live. He also appeared in films like Animal House and The Blues Brothers, showcasing his unique comedic style. Danny DeVito played Hog. He was born in Neptune Township, New Jersey on November 17, 1944. In 1978, DeVito was 34 years old. He is now 78 years old in 2023. Danny DeVito has had a tremendous film and television career. He is well known for his performances in films such as One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest, Twins and Matilda. He has recently found success in his role as Eddie on Jumanji Next Level and he continues to appear in the TV series It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia. Veronica Cartwright plays Hermione. She was born in Bristol, England on April 20th, 1949. In 1978, Cartwright was 29 years old. She is now 74 years old in 2023. Cartwright is a well-known actress who has appeared in science fiction and horror films such as Alien, The Witches of Eastwich and The Birds. She has also been in television dramas such as Alelo and Grey's Anatomy. Cartwright continues to work and has recently appeared in the TV series The Rookie and Gotham Knights. Mary Steenburgen played Julia Tate. She was born in Newport, Arkansas on February 8, 1953. In 1978, Steenbergen was 25 years old. As of today, she is 70 years old. This was Mary's debut performance, which earned her a Golden Globe nomination for New Star of the Year. She lost out to Irene Miracle for her performance in Midnight Express. She has also appeared in Back to the Future Part 3 and Step Brothers. More recently, she appeared in Nightmare Alley as Mrs. Kimball, alongside Brad Cooper in 2021. Richard Bradford played Sheriff Carl. He was born in Conroe, Texas on November 10, 1934. In 1978, Bradford was 43 years old. Unfortunately, he passed away on March 22, 2016 at the age of 81. Richard Bradford is known for his work in both film and television. He appeared in movies like The Untouchables and The Legend of the Lone Ranger. He also had notable TV roles in shows like Man in a Suitcase, and the A-Team. Ed Begley Jr. played Mr. Haber. He was born in Los Angeles, California on September 16, 1949. In 1978, Begley Jr. was 29 years old. He is now 73 years old in 2023. Ed Begley Jr. is well known for his work in films such as This Is Spinal Tap, Pineapple Express and Best in Show. He has also appeared on television in shows such as Saint Elsewhere and Arrested Development. Most recently, you may recognize him as Dr. Link Letter in the hit TV series Young Sheldon. Tracy Walter played Coogan. He was born in Jersey City, New Jersey on November 25, 1947. At the time of filming Going South, Tracy Walter was 30 years old. Today, he is 75 years old. 
Tracy Walter is known for his character roles in numerous films. Some of the notable movies include Repo Man, 1989's Batman, The Silence of the Lambs, and City Slickers. He has also appeared in TV shows like Reno 911 and Breaking Bad. Walter's last film appearance was in 2016 film Wakefield. Thanks for joining us and sticking through to the end. Kindly check out the recommended video on screen now, and until next time, see you then.